Top 10 Places to Visit in Germany 1. Berlin's Brandenburg Gate Modeled on the Acropolis in Athens and built for King Frederick William Mew in 1791, the monumental sandstone Brandenburg Gate in Berlin's Mitte district was the city's first neoclassical structure. It measures an impressive 26 meters in height, which includes the quadriga, the spectacular four-horse chariot carrying the goddess of victory perched atop this spectacular building. Its six huge columns on each side of the structure form five impressive passages. Four were used by regular traffic, while the center was reserved for the royal carriages. Huge toric columns also decorate the two buildings at each side of the gate, once used by toll collectors and guards. Undoubtedly Berlin's most iconic structure, it's hard to believe that the majestic structure you see today was severely damaged during World War II. It was also once part of the infamous Berlin Wall, and for a few decades, was symbolic of the division of Berlin into East and West. 2. Cologne Cathedral, Kölner Dom The towering Cologne Cathedral, Kölner Dom, the Cathedral of Street Peter and Street Mary, is located on the banks of the Rhine and is undoubtedly Cologne's most impressive landmark. This masterpiece of high Gothic architecture is one of the largest cathedrals in Europe. Construction on this most ambitious building project of the Middle Ages started in 1248 and reportedly took over 600 years to complete. As imposing as its facade, the cathedral's magnificent interior covers an area of 6,166 square meters and boasts 56 huge pillars. Above the high altar is the Reliquary of the Three Kings, a 12th-century work of art in gold that was designed by Nicholas of Verdun to house the relics of the Three Kings brought here from Milan. 3. The Black Forest, Baden-Württemberg The beautiful Black Forest, with its dark, densely wooded hills, is one of the most visited upland regions. In all of Europe, situated in the southwestern corner of Germany and extending 160 kilometers from Forsheim in the north to Waldshut on the High Rhine in the south, it's a hiker's heaven. On the west side, the Black Forest descends steeply to the Rhine, crossed by lush valleys, while on the east, it slopes more gently down to the Upper Necker and Danube valleys. Popular spots include Germany's oldest ski area at Tottenham, the magnificent spa facilities of Baden-Baden, and the attractive resort of Bad Liebenzo. 4. The Ultimate Fairy Tale Castle the quaint old town of Essen, situated between the Amergau and Allgau Alps and a popular alpine resort and winter sports center, is a good base from which to explore nearby Neuschwanstein Castle. This spectacular old fortress is widely recognized as one of Europe's most famous and picturesque royal castles. King Ludwig II of Bavaria built this many-towered and battlement-covered fantasy fortress, famous as the inspiration for Walt. Disney's iconic theme park castles, from 1869 to 86. A variety of tour options are offered, including guided tours of the sumptuous interior, taking in the throne room, the singer's hall, and some of the country's most spectacular views. 5. Miniatur Wonderland and the Historic Port of Hamburg In the heart of the historic Port of Hamburg, the magnificent Miniatur Wonderland, the world's largest model railway, is an attraction that appeals equally to young and old alike. Boasting more than 9.5 miles of model railway track, this massive scale model includes sections dedicated to the USA, England, Scandinavia, as well as Hamburg. It also incorporates around 1,300 trains, more than 50,000 microscopic lights, and in excess of 400,000 human figures. It's not unheard of for guests to spend many hours exploring this fascinating world, with its remarkably detailed miniature airports, complete with planes that actually take off, as well as crowded cities, quaint rural scenes, and bustling harbors. For a memorable experience, book one of the behind-the-scenes tours, an especially fun thing to do at night. 6. The Rhine Valley The Rhine is not only Europe's most important waterway, it's also the most beautiful, with a total length of 1,320 kilometers. This magnificent river stretches from Switzerland through Germany all the way to the Netherlands. While there are many places in Germany to enjoy this majestic river, the lovely upper middle Rhine Valley section 
designated a UNESCO World Heritage Site, is probably the most popular spot for tourists to visit. Here this often dramatic 65-kilometer stretch of river boasts more than 40 castles and some 60 picturesque medieval towns, all just waiting to be explored either by river crews or by car. Looking for a great place to begin your Rhine Valley adventure? The historic town of Bingen, where the river cuts through a deep gorge before entering the Backridge Valley, is a good place to start. 7. Berlin's Museum Island Berlin's world-famous Museum Sinsel, or Museum Island, lies between the River Spree and the Kuffergraben, a 400-meter-long canal off the river. This excellent attraction includes many of the city's oldest and most important museums. The heart of this pedestrian-friendly district is the Old Museum. Constructed in 1830, it was designed specifically to exhibit the royal treasures. Soon after, the land behind the museum was set aside for art and the knowledge of antiquity. Between 1843 to 55, the new museum took shape, and the National Gallery was added in 1876, along with the Bode Museum, built in 1904 and home to collections of antiquities. Another highlight of a walking tour of these spectacular points of interest is the Pergamon, with its recreated historic buildings from the Middle East. 8. Munich's Marienplatz Germany's third biggest city, Munich, or München in German, has plenty to offer the adventurous traveler. The capital city of the state of Bavaria can trace its roots all the way back to the 12th century, when a monastery was established here and quickly grew into the region's most important place of trade and commerce. Central to this rise was Marienplatz, the large square where traders from across Bavaria would meet to conduct business, and where locals would congregate to shop and watch medieval jousting tournaments. These days, this vast square still draws crowds of people, but for different reasons. They're here for sightseeing or possibly to enjoy a visit to one of Square's trendy cafes and restaurants, or to shop in its unique boutique stores. 9. Bamberg and the Burgerstadt, Bavaria Located in the Valley of the Regnitz, where the river divides into two arms, sits Bamberg. This old imperial city is the most important town in Upper Franconia and is one of the best preserved of Germany's many charming old towns. It's also one of the best to explore on foot. Your walking tour should begin in its old Episcopal Quarter, home to the 13th century cathedral and the old Benedictine Abbey of Michaelsburg. It's between the two river branches that you'll find spectacular Burgerstadt, a small borough of Bamberg that contains the Groner Markt, an excellent pedestrian zone which is home to the 17th century Baroque Church of Street Martin. 10. Zugspitz Massif, Bavaria Part of the Wetterstein mountain range, the Zugspitz Massif straddles the frontier between Germany and Austria and is surrounded by steep valleys. The eastern summit, at 2,962 meters, is crowned by a gilded cross and can be reached by the Bayerische Zugspitzbahn, a cog railway, or by cable car. Another great way to enjoy this area of outstanding natural beauty is aboard the Tyroler Zugspitzbahn, a railway that runs to the Zugspitzkamp station at 2,000 805 meters. From here, the journey can be continued via a cable car to Zugspitz West Kiffel Station at 2,950 meters. Be sure to sample a meal at the excellent panoramic restaurant located here. What do you think of my video? Let me know in the comment section below. Thanks for watching my video.